welcome you over here to the DDN booth and the overview of the powerful storage solutions that we've developed to be able to help our customers when it comes to dealing with the onslaught of data in their organizations. Now the thing is we are really excited to be back here at Supercomputing again this year. We actually have just launched a brand new homegrown product and it's something that we've been working on for the last eight years. It's called DDN Infinia and I'm telling you I've got more to talk about on that one in just a little bit. But first, DDN as a data solution provider, it is well positioned for the AI market. And we've got over 24 years of experience in delivering innovations and working with customers at tackling data at scale problems. We're ready to serve your AI, your HPC, and your analytics needs today, and also help you plan and adapt well into the future. Now, DDN, we are the largest privately held storage company in the world. And we actually have seen some strong adoption when it comes to the enterprise AI markets over the last couple of years. Now our history of helping customers to tackle the large data challenges and also aid organizations that are trying to maximize their use of data and that way they can gain insights and also drive research and business breakthroughs. We actually have a stable and profitable business model and we can be counted on to be able to work with you as a partner over the long term. Now our development teams, they focus on delivering efficient performance, easy scaling, and also simplifying the management of large data pools. We have a global presence of experts across a broad set of markets, and DDN is the most trusted vendor when it comes to large-scale data deployment uh, solutions. Now because of our performance and our simple scaling, we are an extremely efficient complement to accelerated computing environments and like those that are based on NVIDIA's DGX SuperPods. Now, I'll tell you, our SuperPod reference architecture, which incidentally was developed in cooperation with NVIDIA, it is actually deployed at the largest AI data centers around the world. And DDN's A3i appliances, these are deployed on around 90% of the SuperPods that are available worldwide. This actually includes the largest systems, and those are the ones that are being used by NVIDIA themselves. Now, DDN, with its history of developing storage platforms for data at scale, it has helped customers in a wide variety of industries, and that makes their data more available and available faster. Now, this is going to speed up their processing and their analysis with a simple, scalable approach. Now, this is what really makes us a leader in storage for AI and deep learning applications at scale. Now, I'll tell you, scale, this is really the biggest challenge that a lot of companies that are trying to attempt AI on that wider basis are struggling with. You know, you can take autonomous vehicles as an example. You know, you've got a single vehicle that's generating five terabytes of data an hour. And if you have a fleet of vehicles, we're talking about tens of petabytes an hour, right? Now, DDN, we are well-versed in handling and centralizing analysis for data at this type of magnitude. Uh, of course, this is going to work for other industries as well, like life sciences. This is where you're going to have image analysis that could be generating staggering amounts of data, or maybe financial services. This is where microseconds of latency, this could cost you thousands or even millions of dollars in lost opportunities. DDN, we have engineered and deployed unique data platforms, and these address all of these challenges with the stability, security, and the performance that's needed to create differentiation. Now, it's really our deep expertise beyond the storage systems that allows us to provide this type of comprehensive capability. Now, the thing is, is we're not simply a storage company. What we do is take pride in having experts here that are gonna be able to help our customers to deploy service and also support some of the largest systems on the planet. And I'm gonna tell you that capability is not just being reserved for the large customers. This is also being experienced by every single one of our customers out there. Now, we actually have our flagship appliance right here. This is uh, for AI. This is the DDN A3i AI 400 X2. In an extremely power efficient U2 appliance, we can generate all of the GPU saturating performance that your AI computing systems demand. All right, now a key enhancement that we announced earlier this year, it is incorporation of QLC SSDs and this is into our system. Now I'll tell you, QLC, this is gonna allow us to then supply our customers with cost-effective flash 
capacity. And this is while still maintaining all of the performance characteristics they need and also reduces the capacity cost significantly. It's a win all the way around. Now, if you compare this with, with uh, competitive QL solutions out there, DDN's appliance, it stays super simple. We don't have any requirements for an exotic memory footprint or any kind of complicated switching. Now, we have an embedded NVMe over fabrics network into the expansion enclosures. This is right there in itself. This minimizes the infrastructure that you need to deploy in order to take advantage of QLC. Now, we also have added enhancements to the Exascaler software that runs these systems. And this is with compression that makes the capacity even more efficient for you. And we can deal with I.O. in a way that's really optimized for this type of storage media. So with the addition of QLC to our systems, you're now going to have more flexible deployment options for you. So it means whether you have a need for the ultimate performance or maybe maximum capacity, or maybe you're looking for the most cost-effective storage. The thing is, is you now have the choice with DDN, and it's going to allow you then to optimize your appliance for your specific needs. Now, you might ask, why does efficient storage architecture matter? Well, it really comes down to maximizing the entire infrastructure, compute, network, and storage. Now, by optimizing our systems and optimizing the data paths, you're going to see that DDN is helping you to save time and money. And this is going to give you faster computing results at a lower cost. All right, so now we're excited to talk about the brand new stuff. Now, just last Wednesday, we publicly revealed this project. And like I said earlier, we've been working on this for the last eight years here at DDN. This is DDN Infinia. Now, Infinia, this is taking all of the learning that we've had over the decades that we've been working with data-intensive customers, and it's applying an approach that is based on simplifying everything that's making managing your data at scale such a challenge. Now, what we've done is dramatically simplified deployment, management, security, and also scaling. And this is all while maintaining the aspect that DDN is known for, and that's delivering outstanding low latency performance for you. All right, so what you're looking at up here, this is basically the challenges that we've encountered when we talk with our at scale customers. And this is when it comes to the broader problems of managing their unstructured data at scale. And this is from that wide variety of sources and sensors that they're deploying. Now, these problems, of course, they are not unique to just AI data. But the thing is, is it is the kind of thing that is especially evident when you have customers that are training large models for very complex challenges. Uh, I'll give you an example again with autonomous vehicles. You've got tens of terabytes that are being collected by tens or hundreds of vehicles. Now, this is over multiple cities and in multiple regions. So that means that that data, it's going to have to be classified and filtered. And then you're going to have to route this to the right location for analysis and archiving. And all of this is also while keeping it secure. Your infrastructure is deployed in the field and in data centers and over multiple clouds. And the cost of infrastructure in data management, it's going to continue to grow right along with that influx of data. And the thing is, before today, there was no storage solution that addressed these types of challenges holistically. All right. Modern data systems, they fail to comprehensively address the needs of the sprawling data challenges. Uh, you're going to see strong hardware dependence on things like octane memory. This is going to make transitioning to a multi-cloud model something that's really difficult. Uh, now, solutions, what they do is they often have these gaps in that performance when it comes to writing your data to storage. Uh, the current storage systems, the thing is, they just weren't designed to be cloud native. And they also face a large hurdles, and that's making running over multiple clouds or in hybrid situations, it makes it really complicated and overall expensive. So if customers are looking to share infrastructure and maximize their resources among multiple projects or departments or customers, uh, you know, what they're faced with is some very substantial limitations. Uh, you know, products on the market right now, they've really just had complex and also restrictive multi-tenant capabilities. And these things were built on top of the existing platform, and they were based around closing off those static allocations for individual tenants. And when it really comes down to it, you simply can't continue to manage data at scale if you're going to have all of those types of limitations. 
So this is where DDN's Infinia is going to come to the rescue. You know, DDN built Infinia from the ground up precisely to address these types of modern storage difficulties. Now, it is a completely hardware agnostic, software defined storage system that is gonna be something you can deploy easily from edge to core to cloud. Now, this is all while maintaining the ultimate in efficiency. Now, DDN has focused a massive amount of attention when it comes to low level architecture and also trying to really build something there for you that's gonna be very, very flexible. It's future proof. And most importantly with this is it's designed to simplify the most sprawling of environments. Now, it has a feature in here that's a unique IO engine. And this is going to be ensuring that your operations that are requiring low latency and a high transaction rate, that these are gonna be just as well addressed as operations that require massive throughput and also parallelism. You're gonna see that small IOs and large IOs, these are all gonna be handled optimally. And this is both from a performance standpoint, uh, but also in the way that it's gonna be able to treat your flash devices. Now, uh, this is all being achieved without any intervention from an administrator. This is gonna be completely automatic for you. And that everything in Infinia, this is designed to be completely service oriented. So provisioning storage services from Nvidia, this is gonna be super simple for you, fast. Uh, it's literally just a few button clicks and you have a new tenant that can be configured. It literally takes less than a minute. Now our dynamic designs, this is gonna fit into a way that businesses work instead of some artificial constraints that have been created for us. So these services can be allocated and, and scaled up for you, scaled down for you, whatever you need on the fly, basically just based on whatever your change of requirements are. And because this is completely hardware agnostic, it means that this can be just as well suited for public cloud deployment as on-site. Now, everything within Finia, it was designed with a cloud mindset. Uh, and also with complete data isolation between tenants and also all the data that's being encrypted in there, that means that it has also got that built-in security right at the core. Infinia, this was conceived to provide our customers with the ultimate in cloud experience. It's gonna be simple, secure, flexible, and also very, very high performance. All right, so what we announced here with this initially last week, this is in its first incarnation. Infinia, this is an S3 object store. It's gonna have all of the capabilities that I already spoke about here, and it's also gonna be the highest performance, low latency object storage that's available on the market. Now we're also gonna initially be shipping Infinia as a hardware appliance and supporting this on Google GCP. So the thing that's unique to Infinia here is that we really have no restrictions when it comes to either object size or metadata size. And uh, I tell you, this is something that's gonna be really crucial for AI applications where customers are gonna want to attach a massive amount of date metadata to their objects. Uh, you know, we've already tested hundreds of metadata tags and this is to individual objects. We haven't had any problems. Now, another major differentiator here around object storage for Infinia is gonna be that it's very low latency and also very optimized network communication and that's around the highly optimized S3 implementation. Now, this is gonna be a benefit then because we've got customers out there that previously have been struggling with higher performance applications running against object storage. You know, now, they're gonna have all of those barriers removed for them. So this is gonna open up a whole new world of possibilities and it's for applications that are taking advantage of object storage. And that means that not just for those slower second tier data placement, but we're talking about really as that primary target for applications. Uh, now, in 2024, we are going to be adding additional interfaces, and these are all gonna be native. Uh, that's gonna be things like POSIX file and block export for Kubernetes and OpenStack. Uh, also, we're gonna be announcing additional data movement and also metadata operation features, and that'll be coming on in the coming years for you. So this is how we see Infinia fitting into your data intensive environments. Uh, no, customers that need to have the absolute pinnacle of performance for their workloads, like large language model training, they are gonna still be using the DDN exascaler at the core or that inner ring there. And then Infinia, this is gonna be designed to manage that data on the outer ring. Uh, that's gonna supply a huge performance boost for those applications and then also greatly simplifying the way that customers are handling their distributed data. All right, well with that, I wanna thank you so much for your time and attention over here. If anything I talked about up here piqued your interest and you would like to get additional information about DDN's AI solutions, 
Uh, also, why customers like NVIDIA continue to expand their footprint with us.